in, in the early stages of my career, I was really looking at the whole issue of biomimicry, how to understand and capture the essential processes provided by nature, and then to try and integrate that into urban form, into urban architecture, but still preserving that integrity of the natural processes. For constructed wetlands, for instance, we all know that they do have a very strong cleansing property. But how do you capture the essential of that and repackage it into a high urban form? The, the award, I believe, has to do with how uh, I then put in the effort to make sure that other disciplines are integrated into the delivery of that uh, nature-based solution uh, into cities. It is necessary to apply wisdom gleaned from history and contemporary advanced technology and to take action by collaboration with global society. Yeah, we cannot keep our eyes closed like this and stay ignorant. We really need to take responsibility. There's no time to waste. The great thing about technology is that uh, you know, we can improve a lot of things with it. Yeah? So everything that used to be analog, so now if we can uh, access data or through the sensoring, we can get all that data and we can see through the data. So by applying machine learning and artificial intelligence, these systems can actually learn from the behaviors and that data and propose new solutions. So it will be a lot more efficient yeah, in waste and also to improve the quality of the water if we can measure it uh, with filtering like even in the homes and we can measure that quality of the data, bring all that data together, we, can, we will learn a lot from it. But I realize that there are a lot of other communities in, in Ghana that suffer water problems and we only as a company dwell on the urban areas. So what I did was to go into these villages educate them on water and sanitation best practices and how they can avert some of the challenges that they face in their communities before the government comes in to help. Everything was really good actually. I think uh, the organizing of the conference was perfect and uh, I really enjoyed everything, all the speakers uh, and everything was really good. Congress is showing out where, where the future is and where we, we can go and uh, as outlined water is very important for whatever future development of human society and we are working on that and we are trying to bring their very creative and new solutions. Uh, Tokyo is amazing. I think uh, having the comparison of uh, Gothenburg and then the previous World Water Congress in Brisbane, I think IWA are really getting it right. Uh, I think it's uh, bold. Uh, I, I think it's there's some risks, but at the same time, I think there's a lot to learn from Japan. Uh, and it's ex exciting to see so many um, active members of IWA really committing.